Let's compare some new stuff with some a little bit older stuff. What's up everybody? Welcome to the life of a board gamer. My name is Daniel and today we are going to do a comparison and sort of a review. So we are going to compare this box, Dice Throne Season 1, to this gorgeous thingy called Dice Throne Season 1 Rerolled. So basically what they did is they uh, recreated the, the first version of the game uh, to look more like a second season because second season had way better artwork. Not that anything is wrong with this one, but this one looks, I mean, check it out. It just looks really gorgeous. So yeah. Uh, they uh, updated the artwork and everything so it matches nicely Dice Throne Season 2 and uh, let's get down to the table let me show you quickly what the differences are the main differences we won't go through each and every card or each and every dice but just to show you the main differences and then we'll talk some more about it okay uh, let me quickly show you the difference between uh, this uh, new god gorgeous looking box and this one that also look gorgeous but it's nowhere near the first one so first of all you obviously notice the difference this one is like three times this one is three times higher and it has a linen finish on a box which is absolutely great so and it has really nice artwork inside let me just quickly show it to you gorgeous gorgeously produced box and then we have the older version of the game which looks like this and uh, we received some promo cards so we're gonna just move them aside for now so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to compare two of the heroes let's uh, pick out the moon elf I think it is this one over here so we have moon elf from the base uh, from the new edition and the old edition so Let's check out the board itself. And as you can see, you already see a big, big upgrade, a big difference from the old and from the new box. I mean, it is just, so it first used to look like this and now it looks like this. I mean, it's just gorgeous, gorgeous looking play mat for, for your hero. I, 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 I just love it. So we have this that uh, this card that uh, shows you all the statistics and everything. As you can see, this one is now a little bit uh, smaller in size. So even though this box is bigger, I think the components for the characters you, you take less space uh, in a second edition than in the first. But yeah. Uh, basically uh, everything is really nicely explained they added some extra colors which you will see on a dice so that is that let's just remove all the other guys and let me show you how the dials look well the dials dials are pretty much the same at least these are this one is uh, from the older version is a little bit bigger than this one like in a millimeters bigger and uh, yeah that is that that's the difference pretty much the same thing if you ask me so we have that uh, there is some difference in these dialers that track your health the artwork is different and it goes for all the other characters so now we have dice let me show you the dice now these are the old dice now this is a this is a retail edition this was not a kickstarter edition this is a retail so these dice look like this and they're fine they look really nice but now i have dice that look like this now these one have like a little uh, like a little thing going on with them they have some pattern or something and uh, let me just quickly compare just one dice from new and one from the old set so I just can show you the numbers now have a little bit of difference now they have colors on them so you can easily identify is it attack is it move or whatever it does and uh, as you can see uh, number six is just basically stayed the same but all of the other sides are a bit different and the dice look way way gorgeous here than in this retail edition but 
yeah, it's still a good thing. So the cards for the base game looked like this. It was just a plain text on some different color backs, depending what cards was used for attack defense, if I am remembering correctly. Uh, I haven't played a game in a, in a while now. I definitely will with this edition now out. But yeah, uh, nothing wrong with it. It's really nice, clean design. I have no, uh, nothing against these, but check these cards out. Now, these ones do feel a little bit thicker, do feel uh, like they're a little bit more quality than this one. These cards, these new cards, but the artwork is absolutely gorgeous on this one. So each card has an illustration, has a text, lots of things going on on it. It is just absolutely gorgeously looking. And of course the the component, the tokens, now I still didn't punch these out, but uh, let's just compare, let's say for example, this one, as you can see, they pretty much resemble the already components that we already know. I'm just searching if there's some more now. It's over here, probably on these other tiles or they maybe change this. I'm not really sure, I'll have to check it out. But yeah, as you can see, they are pretty same thickness, pretty same looking components. Uh, and yeah, that is that, that's the comparison, that's the differences and the same things from season one and season one re-rolled. Okay, so that was the Dice Throne season one re-rolled. And uh, there's nothing much to say, the new version looks miles better i was mind blown how great it looks and uh, the great thing is now i i really really like that everything matches in the sense uh, in the means of artwork and uh, dice and everything matches with my season two of uh, dice throne which is uh, which is something that i really like because now i can mash up the characters however i want not that i couldn't do that but you know when somebody's playing with nice cool cards that look super awesome and dice look cool and then somebody has like the basic version of season one character playing against you with just you know it's it's not the same feeling you're not playing the same game even though you do you are not so now everything matches season one season two all the characters look good there's also two extra characters in here which is absolutely great so we have the ninja and the tree ant now i think those were like a fan-made expansions that somehow find their way into this box i'm really not sure but uh, either way i think some gameplays are in order me against slaven in the dice room to see who's the who's gonna take the dice throne. uh so yeah that is that uh, thank you all for watching thank you for subscribing do check out my patreon uh, if you support me there it would help this channel a lot and we have some cool things going on there you can be a part of great campaign going on right now uh, in uh, under falling skies but more on that you will see on my patreon and yeah do join me next time when i will be throwing my dice with only left hand the entire game and until then pozdrav